Hi everyone, Chris here. Just before we start this episode, I just want to give you a little heads up. The audio in this session is a little bit weird. Looks like my recording software got new updates and it reset all my audio settings. So the game is really, really, really loud and, I mean, it's a bit rubbish. I did a lot in this episode though, so I kind of don't want to lose the footage. I'll make it up to you, however, because in episode 50, which is next, coming at the weekend, we're going to have a tour of the nation. We're going to revisit everything we've done. I've purchased a Wartburg ready. I've set the <laughs> set the course. So we're going to have a tour of the nation in episode 50. For now though, episode 49 is here. We do build a lot. The sound is a little bit weird, although the first part, I have something to show you on Blender, so stick around for that. Right, I'll see you in this game. Sorry once again. Hi there everyone, it's Chris here, and welcome back to Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic, and the Democratic People's Republic of Fjordland. You join us looking over Gavusk and the rapidly builded... Builded? Builded? Rapidly being built. English is my first language. Like, it, like I can't even speak it. The rapidly growing nuclear power plant here in the town itself. It's looking really, really good. We have a few things to do today, but before we do any of that, I just want to take you away from this game and show you something really, really quickly. Right then, hello. Something that I really wanted to just quickly show you before we dive into, well, this ep this episode. So, the brainwave that came to me the other day, I was looking for low-rise uh, Khrushchevska type, um, type buildings for Fjordland, and I couldn't really find anything that was on the Steam Workshop that I really, really liked that's not to say that there aren't some amazing mods on there there really are but there was nothing that i was like oh this this fits what i'm looking for and it got me thinking that i actually really like the idea of creating our own fjordska that's right a fjordska a fjordland's own architectural cheap housing block this is the fjordska um, I've been working on it for the past few days, um, and here's the here's the thought process behind it. Then, so as we build these new towns, as we look to to build the cultural city in the future, what I'd love to do is be able to run another one of those little propaganda film things at the start, talking about the jolly old time of moving into your own house, provided by the Fjordland government. You know that type of thing. Um, so, we, so we've got this. Let me show you how, how this thing is working then. So, the Fjordska itself is... Um, uh, this is this is the smallest of the units. But the way I've built them is that currently everything is, is still separate. But if I... Um, just, just, to, just, to, just to show you my, my, my working out here. So, the thought process being, though, that we've, we've got this here like this... Uh, this can be the smallest of the units, but if I... The good thing about panel buildings is it, all you need to do is pretty much copy it over and then you've got an extra large building, you know? I, I love the idea. Um, another good little thing that is going to be great about the Fjordska is the skin itself. You can see these are all a tiled wall. A lovely blue hue, uh, as is the front here. I'm going to make a variety of skins for it, so that it doesn't have to be blue if you don't want it. Uh, it can be different colours. Comment below what um, what type of colours you think these buildings should be. We could also change even the, the pebble dash concrete here, this rough looking concrete. We can change that maybe. If I just quickly... Have I shut? No, no, I haven't shut Photoshop. This is the texture file itself. Um, you can see that we've got the, the rough concrete, the, the tiles there. Um, I'm still working on this and adding little details here and there. By no means is um, 
is this Fjordska finished? Because uh, another thing I'd like to do is I'd like to add some little details to these balconies. Uh, some washing, hanging up, that type of thing. And so I've left myself some room to do. You may notice this dude here, this, this mosaic. That's because another thought that I've had is including a... Let me just quickly... Um, I'm going to have to do to render. I hope this doesn't... include this in in the skin and then I can also take it out and because of the way the, the workers and resources works um, if there is nothing there to read it won't show it so we can have it invisible and appearing on some skins I'm trying to find other things to replace this with uh, other mosaics that will nicely fit the bill uh, but it's it's really exciting I'm, I'm really really happy with how this building is is shaping up uh, you can see balconies along the back um, as well what do you think what do you think of this building what do you think it is currently missing or any changes i'm not going to change the the build of the the building i really like how it's made uh, i really like its its layout but if you can if you've got any ideas on color schemes you'd like to see implemented alongside this building and how what like so this is the smallest size what should we have like a, a, a three times as big one you tell me what type of things would you would you like to like to see right these are coming soon to a fjordland near you they're still still on the architectural drawing boards of the of the planning committee so, <laughs> so they'll, they'll get there though maybe in the next episode who knows uh, until then see you back in the game i guess Right, so there you go. What uh, what do you think? Do you like the look of those Penelkas? These panel buildings, the Fjordskas themselves? I'm really excited by them. I, I really enjoy making them. And I'm really looking forward to getting them in the game. Uh, specifically for our cultural city, but we've got a lot more to, to build and do. Let me come down here because it would appear... It would appear that these little housing units are nearly done. And look at all these people going to... Are they working at the post office? Or are they visiting? There's a lot of visitors. A lot of visitors. Things are slowly growing in Fjordland. Well, one of the suggestions, uh, I believe, from East of GMT on YouTube comments from... Not the last video, but the video before, was that Gvusk is crying out for a university. And um, you're right. You're absolutely right. In fact, the idea was that we could have a little passenger a boat station here and a passenger boat thing here. And we could ferry university students. Those from the fishing town who need to access higher education could come to Gvusk. And I really like that idea. So here's what we're going to do. We have this... I want to say it's a lovely area, but this here looks... Can I, can I lower that? It just looks very rocky to me, you know? That's better. That looks better. Uh, we need a, a passenger one. We'll do it a small one. Please fit. I hope you fit. It fits. Awesome, awesome. Uh, yeah, we're not altered building, so that's always a positive. We will... The, Get rid of that for now and we'll put a bit of dirt in so people can come and make it. Then we've got to decide on the university. Now, I do think that this space here is perfect for the university. Uh, I haven't decided on which one yet, so let's have a quick, quick butchers of what we've got. We've got this massive tower which definitely does not fit. Uh, Ministry of Defence, Medical University. I think with Gavusk being a nuclear city, it really needs to be a technical university to tr uh, learn, to learn, not to learn, to, to teach those chemics, chemists and engineers in the future. Now this building looks pretty, pretty cool. It's a little bit big, and I like it. So uh, east of GMT, you want this? I mean, as much as it's a great model, the uh, Palace of the Republic from the DDR, it is pretty much like it's a bit big from from my from my wants and my tastes. We've got our own 
Ooh. Could I fit? I could fit. Now, the House of the Soviets is not a technical university. It is a uh, party headquarters, which is great. And I mean, the, the universities all do the same thing anyway. They don't teach doctors or whatever. Like, they look cosmetically different, but I don't believe there's any fundamental differences in them. I'm tempted by my, my House of Saviors, but I kind of feel like I want to save the House of Saviors for, 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 for the cultural sake. the road structure, which would be a shame. I love this building. I love this building in real life. It's from Kiev. Um, oh, Kiev. How do you put it? I don't know. How do, how is it properly pronounced? Is it Kiev? Um, maybe that's another one to say for the port for town. You're just tiny. Got somewhere in the middle. It's just not in the middle. What have I got? But everything is massive, guys. I guess that that's decided then, isn't it? If, if we can't get anything to fit, I'm not putting another Ministry of Interior down. We have one already, somewhere. Uh, we're going to go with this then. It's the House of the Saviors. That's what we're going to find. You pushed me to it. You pushed me to it. I, I guess that's what the, it, the game was telling me. No, Chris, we need to go with this. Right, so we'll connect it up. We will connect this up and we will ask our construction people, of which we have many, to, to come and make a start. So that is going to look ridiculous. Are you excited for it? Okay, okay, so we built that. We've got that up and running. We've got. So let's put everything on fast forward for a bit and watch as things grow. But these residential buildings are going to be done soon as well, by the looks. How much longer? Not long at all. And, incidentally, what I found earlier was these tunnels don't have long to go either. And once we get those up and running, the journey to and from Gavus to the nuclear industry should not take too long. Tell you what is taking a long time though. The farms. But you already knew that. We've got all the fishing town to build. Another thing that I'm going to put when we make our cultural town, uh, uh, you may have seen this on the Steam Workshop a few weeks or a days ago now. Uh, this, the defense of the motherland or the motherland monument. Look at this thing. I'm not going to build it because we're going to save it. But I'm really happy with how this model has turned out. It's a gorgeous model. I can't take credit for it, it is uh, a third party model that I have simply managed to amend and change for, for the purposes of this game. I, the, the base model itself is by someone far more talented than me, but it is great. One thing I have made, however, is this, this lovely hammer and sickle, which we can put somewhere where, uh, do you know what, we're going to put hammer and sickle here. Just on the motorway, it feels like it makes sense. You come down here before you get on the bridge, and there's a hammer and sickle waiting for you. There we go. We'll connect that up, and we'll ask all the construction people to do a job when they get the time. There is so much happening in our Republic right now. Um, new vehicles all the time, helicopters whirling around, roads getting built. 
towns getting made. It really is a, a, a worry as to what we're going to do at the moment. Let's just check in on some things. It looks like this has been finished. This was the distribution centre to build the... To, to ship some chemicals places. But we've also got a small plastic tractor. Except it's not a small plastic tractor. It's quite a large one. Uh, getting ready to be to be built as well. So... Your question is, do we want to start shipping chemicals... We are producing our own chemicals now, which kind of means we kind of don't need this power anymore. Right? Where is it? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell this to you. We're gonna, we don't, I don't think we need to be importing chemicals anymore. Let's make that decision. Let's stop. Pause the Let's set up a line. Unemployment is too high in a new place. That's it. Let's do some covered holes. We want some nice and fast ones, but also can carry a lot. As always, I think that that's going to be the MZ 504s or 504s. They can carry three. Can anything carry more chemicals? You can, but you're slow as bolt. So it's going to be you. And we're going to get but, I don't know, four of them. Four of them here. Tell them. We'll call this the chemical. Chemical. Um, chemical. Chemical root. That's a good one, isn't it? Uh, yes, that's fine. But you're going to come here. No, oh, no, that's not. Can't do that. Okay. You can't specify if this is happening. Chemical room, delete the line. Let's, let's try this. Um, pick a, pick a, a lorry. Oh no, I can't make the room. I'm thick. The distribution. Yeah, you were all shouting, weren't you? You're going, Chris? Chris, mate. It is a distribution centre you've set up. Thick. Man. We'll set them up there, and we'll set them up to unload their chemicals. There. At 50%, I think is reasonable. That should set them off to begin with. Let's see if they're going to go and do their job. Oh no, they're not going to because uh, actually we have a flipping ton of things got into the pocket. Find all those lorries. We want to find them while we want to return them to their depot. Very, very quickly. You. There's your depot. Turn there. You. Turn there. You. Turn there. You. Turn there. You. Turn there. there we go. Right, that'll that'll sort sort some stuff out for a little bit. Hopefully these guys will use some chemicals. Oh, we cannot... Whoa, 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 whoa. We cannot store or export. Have we filled up our... Holy... Holy moly, we have filled everything up. And this has not been built yet. Right, well, we're kind of at a bit of a standstill, aren't we, then? A little bit of a standstill. I'll tell you one thing I do want to do. This is nuclear fabrication and this is nuclear conversion. I want to build another conversion plant. Because we're making so much stuff here that it kind of makes sense to have another conversion plan. So, um, forgive me, but that's what we're going to do. We're probably, I mean, we're making a lot of chemicals. We're probably going to fit another Where would we put it? Where would we put it? I guess we could put it. Because I'd want it to have its own chemicals again. Uh, I've not really thought this through to expand this bit out, have I? 
let's let's get a small, a tiny, a tiny little thing. Ooh, where's the small? Okay, well that brings more questions really. I wanted to make more stuff. How much out of interest? Prices. UF6. <laughs> Look how much that is. I'm just thinking, well this isn't ready. And we want them to keep producing. We could sell it. Like, just sell it for the time being. Sell it to our... I don't know, our Soviet friends. How would we sell it? How would we do that? What would we do? We need some lorries, wouldn't we? Like, you guys. Uh, can you carry UF-6? Can anyone carry UF-6? What carries UF-6? What vehicle can carry UF-6? What can you carry UF6? It's got to be an open hole, right? Got to be. No? Oh, I expect. No, 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 it is, it is, isn't it? It's got to be because they can load things onto a flatbed and. What? Should we try it? Let's try it. Let's very quickly buy ourselves in. Let's buy ourselves in. I quite liked that one we were hovering. Oh, and it's got a crane. Oh man, you are beautiful. What colour can you do? Can I make you a lovely... I'm going to keep you blue. I'm going to keep you blue, man. So go here. Pick up... Container. Oh, sh yes, son. And then... I guess we want you to come all the way down to, to this border, right? Look at it. Look at it. And we're going really quick. Let's just follow it <laughs> That was a bit just crazy. Do you like the um well, the game say? Do you like the Ernst Stalman memorial there if you go past it? Work. It's gonna work. Um, crash. Oh right, it's down this way. Oh man, this could be good. This could be fun. It'll be great when the tunnel is complete because then these vehicles hopefully will realize some of these vehicles will realise they're bad to just go around. Look at the janky road, that's ridiculous. But things are getting built slowly. Gradually, hopefully we'll be able to make more stuff. Right, is he going to load up? Show me what... Where have you gone? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's got a nuclear barrel in the back. <laughs> I love pause, 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 pause. Because that is... That is crazy. Okay, okay, okay. Well... Ah, so we've got you doing that. Would it make sense to build a little distribution office, or...? What are you guys doing? You are... you are bringing... Oh, you're my little... you're my little people who bring stuff to the railway construction. No, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Uh, we will call... Where's that... where's that truck gone? Where are you, little boy? Looking incredible, like that is it? Okay, that's a lot. How do I? Let's go to this. We'll call this nuclear sales. Yes. Yeah. 
we'll let him go. We're gonna build. We're gonna. I'm gonna buy more. I'm gonna buy more of those vehicles. They're awesome, and I love them. And I want it. I want more people selling stuff. One, one, two. Let's. Because then, with them in on a custom line, you can always just call them back in eventually. There we go. Let's read some notifications. We've got a little bit of a traffic jam somewhere. Unemployment is too high over here. Let's deal with that then. This building has been. Wow, that's a lot of workers without, without work. Um, that's a lot of them. Hopefully. Guys, can you reach the bus stop? Can you reach the bus? Guys, can you reach the bus? Why are you going round the wrong way? That seems a very interesting. Why, why are none of them? Why are none of them crossing this way? Is it quicker to go this way than it is via the path? I'm gonna I'm gonna walk a bit to very very quickly and we'll forget the for it, so. Yeah! Oh wow! That was what Jana a Jana got famous saying in the comments of the other day. That the that people will go on faster routes. Look at that. Well we've got a flipping ton of people coming and living here and working in there. I hope some of these people will come and build some buildings for us. Nice, let's put a little path in here. A lot. Hopefully, some people will go and work on now. And what is this? Another traffic jam. Where? Whoa! Oh. Oh. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You are right about that. You are right about that. There is definitely a traffic jam. Okay, uh. I'll tell you what, let's get that across to there. We'll construct that bit later. That is a lot of traffic going on over here. We, I've changed the roads layout a little bit again because I think Jana, you mentioned that the bridges weren't working, and you were right. Thirty-five flipping million. Is the statue nearly done? Okay, well, let's pause very, very quickly and let's, um, oh, okay, we need to do that, just build that up very quickly, um, so where are all these people going, are they in reach of, yeah, they're in reach of everything, so that's, that's alright, what we need then is, we, we really could do with them coming down here and, and helping build stuff, oh, you don't want to be unemployed, come and help build us some cool, cool stuff, you know? Uh, please, just, is this not going to work? I want people to come and, and oh, 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 okay, didn't mean to do that. I, I was hopeful that people would Come and, and come and work down here, but that's clearly that's clearly wishful thinking, isn't it? Can I put like a crossing there? Will they? No. And, like, there's a lot. There's a lot of jobs that need doing. People come and do them. There is a lot of work that needs to be done. A lot of people can't get to meet, but I don't know if that's just because they're being fit. Oh no, that is because there is literally no meat. That is your meat, Laurie. Oh, bro, look at that. Where's all the meat, man? Oh, oh, that is a concern. Where's the meat? Oh, that is a concern, isn't it? Well, I guess that brings me on to what I'd like to do today, then. Where's this on the map? so much unemployment. Right, okay, okay, okay. So we've got... Let me pause the game quickly. I'm going to build something quickly today. We've got the fishing town that's coming together. Um, 
what we need is ranches. Ranches are plenty. Cowboy time. We need meat to feed the people, and we're not making enough meat. Which sucks because there may be an easy way to fix this. There isn't. It's this train line here that's slow. But we have got it set up so that there is a lot of meat we could take. Mm. And this is made on the... Mm, right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. We're going to make a small meat train. Meat train! A very small meat train. This is going to come down here. Put into there, like so. Um, this is going to be rubbish, isn't it? What I need, what I really need, is I need that there like that. Just trying to think how it how this works. No, 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 not like that. We need that there like that, and then that going back there. Awesome. So our train can be here, but what we need desperately is a. How do? How's this going to work? No, because. These probably need to be a chain as well. Does that, does that work? Can, I, can these be a chain? No, because they look ahead to... I don't understand. I don't understand what they need to be. I probably should just make it a double... A double thing all the way, right? Shouldn't I? I probably should. That makes more sense. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. What? Why? Come on, let's just build build a railway like a chump, Chris. There. Then how is how is it how are you doing this, Chris? Where does this even go? I wanna join the the main rail. So it needs to This needs to go here. And then we need... No! No, 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 no. Is it that? Let's do it properly. How, how am I going to do this? I can't work it out. I can't work it out in my head. Oh, shit. I'm just built it. So if this goes... Let's delete all this. For a start, let's delete it. So this needs to come down to, to here, to there. So one way going in, and... Um, oh no, and I've made them electric, and I didn't want to make them electric. Let's make them petrol. This comes into here, and I need another that kind of joins the same rail, right? So then that goes far. Oh, ram it. That goes that way. That goes that way. And we clear this. We build another, we build it across. Like so. We have one way is chain. Going that way. And like so. Awesome. That makes a lot of sense. Next, we need to... I thought I was going to build some ranches today, and I still might, but at least if we do things this way, it means that um, trains... We, we may be able to quell some of the meat first. Is that a phrase that people would say? Meat firsts. Okay, okay, okay. This is looking decent. Oh, Brammer. Going there. Like so. Does that work? It works to me. Right, we're buying a train. Choo, choo, mother flipper. So what have we got? What have we got? A diesel locomotive. A diesel locomotive. We've not bought one of these in ages. Look at this, a new one. I mean, it goes fast. 
It's not the fastest. That is this Polish bad boy. But it's quite good. What's its empty weight? It is heavy. Uh, I feel like this this new one, as good as this one is, and it is, it's very good. Look at its empty weight. It weighs a lot more. It can go 15 kilometers faster, but its engine is not as good. So let's buy one of these. And let's buy a cargo wagon. How much can you carry in one refrigerated thing? 22 tons. Mm. We're going to be buying a lot more meat, I feel, by doing this. But, let's see if this will work. Come down here. What? You... Come down here. Load up the meat. And then, I need you to come down to flipping where? I want it to come to Gavusk wherever Gavisk is, here. Unload the meat. Go. Let's follow the choo-choo. Presumably it needs to get petrol first, but apparently it is going to go for it anyway. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Oh, it seems to be doing its job. Doing there, it wouldn't let me zoom out. I want to. Oh, okay, no. What? There we go. Let's follow it that way. It's a bit more reliable up here. There we go. So we come along. You pause. Fill it with. Fill it with all the beef. And we're taking a lot of beef here now. Holy cow, that's a lot of beef we're taking. But it shouldn't take them too long to re remake all the beef. And now you're going to take the beef. That's great. Look at the beef. And hopefully it won't have any problems. Snaking its way downtown. Walking fast. And now it's getting petrol. Okay. That makes sense. This is awesome. We've got a beef train. That is a really nice model train. Oh, the train makes it a bit crazy there. As we follow this train down, the train line. Cool, 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 cool. So, 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 so. A lot of building still needs to be done in and around we need to plan the cultural city let's we'll go there next to have a chat about that because uh, julia of julia stock fame has suggested something that i'm very you know i, I quite like the idea oh the crops are getting harvested that's great another season has gone by without the new farm being introduced but hey well This is looking good. Look at all, look at all the progress we've made, though. Like our our country is genuinely beautiful. Fjordland is genuinely beautiful. I believe so. Anyway, the one thing, the one thing that I and I don't know how I remedy it because it's just the way I've played the game. But I've set up so many different systems. There's so many lorries going different places that I. I don't have an overview of everything. Fjordland is chaotic. Like, Fjordland is so chaotic. Oh my god. The motherland calls. Looks like it's finished. We'll go visit that in a second as well. But yeah, the way... We've got so many trucks going around doing jobs. We probably... Could, like, we're pro... We're not the most efficient of nations. Despite the fact that we are now, like, what? Nearly 40 million rubles at the end of the first bloody decade. I don't feel like I've been the most efficient at working this. Like now, we could probably make ranches to, to get more meat, but we're running a train from the border town to the centre just to just so that Gavusk gets meat. It's a bit ludicrous, isn't it? Oh, that statue looks absolutely gorgeous on the hill. Really chuffed with that. Really chuffed with that. So that's another thing built, at least. What about Gavusk, then? How are we going to get 
I don't know, employment up down there. We've probably lost a load of people in the time that it's took me to take a train ride down. But let's, let's... Oh, God, unemployment is too high again. Okay, okay, people. Here we go, look at it. Meat, 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 meat in the meat locker. Flipping awesome. That's awesome. Right, what are we... Let's take a look at our... Oh, no, we've, we're not... I mean, we are making loads of money, but what have we spent a lot of money on livestock? Yeah, we're using more livestock. Of course we are. Because more people are here. We have so much unemployment in Gversk. Holy flipping cow. That's insane. Why is there so much unemployment? I suppose we need to get all this facilities up and running, but... This is, this is, uh, we, we need things to build quicker, please. Can you please build everything quicker? Because, because people are, people are jobless. Things to hurry up. It's, a, it's an issue of resources getting down more than anything. Like concrete isn't here. We've, we Incidentally, I have built, um, over here, look. We've got some, some asphalt production, we've got a concrete thing. We've got all these pieces of... We've, we've got stuff, we, we have things. Can a helicopter carry? No, a helicopter can't carry concrete. That's such a stupid thing to suggest, Chris. But we do need, like... We're going to go look at the statue in a second, don't worry. But, like, what's... Concrete. 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 Like, it's concrete that's always... Seen. Concrete and gravel seems to be holding us up a lot. I kind of feel like, do we make a construction place that's purely just concrete pieces? Would that do a job? Because we've got a few construction places here, but if we had one that was just purely ditching out concrete... Look at this, by the way. Look at this thing. <laughs> That is awesome. It looks out over our farmland. Oh man, that is gorgeous. I love that. Really love that. I just don't want more vehicles running on the road just yet, but I kind of... If I put... I'm going to water build. And I know you, you guys... Some of you think auto building's fine and others don't. I uh, twenty or thirty-two concrete fixes. What do we think? I kind of like the idea of just a flippin' massive concrete. Two concrete mixers is that excessive? Like we've got a lot of vehicles darting around anyway. It would make more sense. You can't store concrete either, though, can you? That's the problem. Maybe something smaller. Ten concrete mixes. That seems a little bit more economical, right? We'll build it. We'll also build it. We'll build it here. We'll call it the uh, Eisenherstadt. Eisenherstadt. And they are going to have all I love these ones by the way. They're awesome. Uh, what's the fastest? It's you. We're gonna buy ten of you. Ten of you bad boys. Your sole purpose in life, guys, mm. is to get concrete. That's that's the only thing you're doing. And we are going to um, assign you to the job. Now we're gonna we're gonna ask them to, to start delivering on that concrete to the first. Oh man. The nuclear power plant is really coming together. Unemployment is still too high. Which building is this one? Yeah. Yeah. We 
no kindergarten. That's interesting. Because there certainly is a kindergarten. Are you telling me we need more but there's this is what confuses me every time. There's only twenty two staff here. Are you saying if we need a new kindergarten, I'll make you a kindergarten, guys. That'll that'll helpfully six hundred kids. I think this is what I mean. Six hundred kids could go here if you all put your back into it. We'll build another one here. And we'll put it. They're just so small. We kind of. I want a big one. How many kids can you have? 220. Three. Okay, we'll go for this. This thing looks cool. Garden of, of hope and truth. Let's. We need to build something else. We. We'll, what should we build? Let's put something in between here because I kind of feel like these people are struggling. Um, I don't know what to put them. I don't know what to give them. Something cultural, maybe. A cinema. What type of cinema can they have? Um, or a or an amphitheater, or a, I don't know. They need something to keep them occupied because they're doing my nutting. A little light. Oh, that's massive. That's stupid. Tiny house of culture. No, 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 no. There's nothing here. I'll tell you what, we will give them sports. A little. A little. Oh, you're not little in the slightest, are you? Volleyball, football. How about a little football pitch? How about two? How about two little football pitches? Don't you in Fjordland? They come from all over. They're like, oh, I love my football, Chris. Why can't I get the paths to connect? That's a good question. It's a question no one's considered. Okay. So this has been done. Can you connect? Yeah, you can. I guess we'll have to connect it up there. Yes. Oh, you were, you were, come on, you were there then, you were there, you were there. You flipping Perhaps it just so annoying. The noise in this game is like, I'm not trying to work. Oh, don't tell me it's too short. There. One day, this will all connect up. But it's not today, is it? It's stupid. I wonder if people will come and work here and build it. I wonder if anything will happen. So... Oh, this has got away from us. I was going to build some ranches. I wanted to build some ranches, and I want to find the perfect location for these ranches. I don't think over here we've got oil towns that we can exploit over here, but I don't really want to put in too much more to be built at the moment while stuff is still getting built. Cultural city-wise, as, as um, I alluded to, um, Julia of Julia Stock fame suggested that Site 1 here should be an industrial town, the, we've got uranium here to exploit. We can make a industrial town. And over here, on the northern banks of the Yoruga <laughs> River, um, we can have the cultural city itself right here. I really love that idea. I think that it's a grand idea. We've got a new type of vehicle ready. Why can I not click on you? Am I being fit? There we go. So we're not gonna. So this one is gonna be industrial city, or the industrial sit, as it says. Over here, industrial. Over there, cultural. And of course, they're gonna need a big bridge. So I'm thinking, let's put in the foundations of a bridge. A very big bridge. What do you, what do you think? What's gonna be a good bridge? I kind of want it to look the part. But 
70. I feel like the biggest one, it needs to be this because we want to be able to, to get boats going across it. So. Going across like so. Is that in a straight line? Is it bum in a straight line, guys? Is it bum in a straight line? Oh, there's a hill obstructing it, is there? What do we think? Is that a good place for a bridge to cross? And then it could go down. The grand Fjordland suspension bridge. It's not, a suspe it's not even a suspension bridge. Yeah, well done. Well done for... Well done there, Chris. It's not even a suspension bridge, is it? Lovely. It's going to take forever. We're never going to get here. We will. We will. But it's a big infrastructure project. It's a one day build. The Molna Bridge. The Molna Bridge will cross the Aruga here. You can have a Statue of Liberty stat here. <laughs> or maybe even. Defense of the motherland. No, 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 because the defense of the motherland needs to go on a hill, sitting, sitting, sitting opposite. We've got more trains that cannot pass. Why? I don't really understand what's happened here. It's looking ahead. This says that it can't go because... If you're looking ahead to here, neither of these can go because there is a train there. But you... Come on, that doesn't make sense. That doesn't make any sense. It's because we've connected this back up, but I don't really... That doesn't make a lick of sense, you know? I don't know how we solve that. If anyone comments below how we solve this interchange so more trains can go in at once, because I don't really know what's done there. Don't really understand. But okay, okay, it's fine. We're not even selling the fuel at the moment. That's the best bit. Like, not even selling fuel. Oh man, we are in the money so to speak, in the money and doing well, doing very well. Right, I don't know what else to do today, I'm not sure what else I want to achieve, I don't think we've done too much, I wanted to show you the video, um, the, the buildings, once again, this, this here, has it been not done? How long has it got? The farm is going to be finished soon. This piece is sure rubbish. Hey, hey, progress, progress. It was a, it, last time we looked. It was at 1.5 mil or even 1.9 mil. So something is happening. Scaffolding is up soon. I, I, I'm gonna put my hat um, and say that I reckon. No, I was gonna say by this time next year. It'll be done. This time in two years' time, I reckon this will be done. Oh my god, we've got new... We've got new... Let's just check out for a second. A new ambulance. A new type of crime. Unemployment is high. We know unemployment's high. But if these people really didn't want to... If these people really wanted to not, you know, go... Wanted a job... We, like, look, look... Must be a reason why you are not going to work. It's, it just has to look. It's annoying. What is happening? Why are they not wanting to? Why are they not wanting to? There we go. There we go. 
Okay, that's a bit better. That's a little bit better. Why would you guys go to work? Let me just... Let's just ditch some... In fact, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to be annoyed. And I'm, and I'm, I'm going to apologize. Sometimes just this game is Okay, so so now they're walking places. We're selling meat out there. Meat here. Meat out here. Okay, so so things are happening. Still, only fifteen people on this construction site. Some things. You're unemployed, guys. Go and work on a building site for a bit. You you were within walking distance. There must be, I don't know what I'm going to put in. I'm going to say I'm going to put in. We want them working in this nuclear industry, and at some point they will once it's all done. There's a lot of unemployment in it. A lot of unemployment that hopefully we'll be able to solve soon. Oh, it's going up, and there's a lot of people living with their parents. Hopefully. I mean, there is a lot of people living in these buildings, to be fair. What can we do before we go? Oh, we could put in another university. We could put in another university. Something down here to help suck up some of the population. A little technical university. Something here that doesn't cost loads and we'll still have a lot of people left over to go work in the nuclear stuff, because I think Gavusk is going to have a lot of people, isn't he? Let's put this down. Oh. Dollars, we've got dollars. Awesome. This is looking good, guys. That's what we're going to build, then. We'll, we'll, we've got two universities now at Gavusk. Well, technically, technically, this is a, a Communist Party headquarters, and this is the university. If we're being technical about it, but this is going to be good. Hey, look, some tower blocks are going up as well. Right, let's leave it there. Right, as always, he's so busy. Comments below on uh, on anything really. Color schemes for the buildings. Uh, Thoughts on what we can do with our nation. Anything, anything really. Thank you so much for watching and enjoying the series so far. I hope you are. I hope you're still enjoying it. If you have any suggestions on how we can improve, as always, I'm, I'm always open to, to hearing. I always want to know what you'd like to see and what type of things you want. Hopefully, in the one after this, we will have some forge. for fjordskas. Fjordskas to build in a, in new towns, but until then, it is very much a, a building game. Now it looks like autumn is approaching, and we are going to have winter soon. It may be winter in the next episode because I may play some off camera. Right, stay safe, people. Have yourselves a lovely week, and I will see you in the next one.